Hello everyone, this is Methlo Kaiju, and I'm back with another Godzilla vs. Kong video. This will be a prediction slash speculation video. So, what are we talking about in this episode? Or episode, what in the world? In this video, we're going to talk about when is the trailer dropping. Is it dropping during San Diego Comic Con? Is it dropping November 2020? And then Godzilla vs. Kong gets delayed to March 2021. Uh, which is that's not actually that could actually happen. I'm, I'm just saying that could theoretically happen But I really really doubt it. It's gonna be released between April and May like that sci-fi super reliable article stated No, okay, definitely not cuz I mean it's sci-fi first of all second of all that's an April Fool's joke so and since sci-fi is already fake news and therefore that article is giga hyper mega fake news Okay, do not believe that whatsoever. That's an April Fool's joke Okay, I've seen a ton of videos on that. People getting all hyped for literally nothing. Okay, I'm very sorry to break it to you, but that, that news article is fake. But anyhow, let's get into some background information first of all. So Legendary recently announced they will be having a MonsterVerse watch along where fans can independently come together to watch the three films in the MonsterVerse. Here are the dates of the schedule's plan. So there you have it right there. Godzilla 2014. Kong School Island, King of the Monsters, and they fall on Thursday, so that's kind of interesting, which I'll talk about that in a few minutes. Along with this legendary, very recently replied to someone on Twitter who was asking when the trailer is coming, and they basically tweeted the following right here. So they said, quote unquote, the day we get to share the Godzilla vs. Kong trailer with you will be a true celebration. But in the meantime, we hope this watch along is a fun way for all of us to come together with our favorite titans. We're sorry to get any hopes up and look forward to sharing some easter eggs with you. So as you can tell, yeah, we're not getting a trailer next week, okay? Oh well, I guess. So before I go over the possible dates, let me just say and speculate that the trailer probably is already done and completed and is just getting ready to be released. And so wh why do I say this exactly? Well, first off, let's go back to the tweet that I kind of went over a little bit. And the language of it, I don't know, kind of insinuates so that the trailer is already done, but they simply haven't released it. I don't know, it's just a hunch of mine. They just, I just get that vibe from it. But again, that's terrible evidence, right? But this is more conclusive evidence right here. Okay, well, Sayaka, which, if you don't know who Sayaka is at this point, I don't know, you've been living under a rock, I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, so, you know, I've said this guy's name, or girls, sorry, I know a lot of people in the comment section are upset. That I keep saying Sayaka is a he, mistakenly, so. I know, Sayaka is a female name, I know. But it's also an anime character name, so that person could have just used the anime character name. Or it could be the, I don't know, whatever, I'm just rambling on. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. But, uh, yeah. He slash she stated on the forums that they'll be leaving for a little bit. And that they'll be back once the trailer hits. Well, guess what? The trailer never hits. And then Sayaka came all of a sudden. And he started to, you know, drop some little things here and there about Nozuki and whatever. And then some people were saying, oh, you're back, right? That's kind of cool. So what happens to the trailer? And then Sayaka said, because of the coronavirus. So, yeah, that basically kind of confirms that the trailer did get delayed because of the coronavirus, COVID-19, SARS-CoV-2, you know, whatever you want to call it. It got delayed by the current pandemic we're currently in. So I guess that is pretty unfortunate. So... With that in mind, um, let's just get right into the possible trailer release date. So, when is it releasing? Well, it all depends whether Godzilla vs. Kong stays with its current release date of November 2020. And there's some good reasons to actually move it and delay it. And there's some good reasons to leave it as is. And I'll probably do a separate video on that. So, on this video, I'm just going to assume that it stays where it is. So, there is that, and let us begin now. I know, I'm very sorry for taking four minutes to get to the point, I'm sorry. So, some people have recently stated, based off the dates, Legendary posted for the watch along, which again, here they are, that the trailer could potentially release the 30th of April. Pretty reasonable prediction, and the reason why they say that is because, as I've mentioned earlier in the video, each one of these is a Thursday. Right, well, maybe next Thursday, we could have a Godzilla vs. Kong trailer. So, again, pretty reasonable, pretty logical, but I think that's too early. And normally, I wouldn't say that if we lived during normal circumstances, 
but we simply aren't in normal circumstances. We're living during a pandemic, okay? This is not normal whatsoever. So releasing a trailer at a time when the pandemic is still killing hundreds in the US every single day alone, it might come off as a bit insensitive and a bit tone deaf to be releasing a trailer. So, I mean, that's just my opinion. If Legendary kind of wants to risk it and just release it, that's fine. And their logic could be, well, a lot of people are staying home and they're getting kind of bored. So let's just release the trailer. They could have that logic. But again, I do think they will face some scrutiny for releasing a trailer during, you know, an active pandemic, in my opinion. So speaking of the pandemic, experts have stated that the COVID-19 surge in the U.S., could start leveling off in the next two weeks but society in the u.s won't return back to any type of normalcy until late june or july and along with this the president has said he wants to open the country soon although he has not specified an exact date like last time so i think the u.s or sorry the virus in the u.s at least will start settling down in july or optimistically june uh, so by this time you know, late June, July, other countries who are about to reach a surge right now should have at least leveled off by then, hopefully. So, you know, maybe July. I think July is a pretty good date. So speaking of July, guess what else is happening in that month and hasn't been canceled yet? Yes, San Diego Comic-Con. So yeah, pretty good time to release a trailer then because there's going to be plenty of people. Okay, and yes, there might be social distancing guidelines. Hopefully there is social distancing guidelines, which prevent people from being super jam-packed in a room. Yeah, sure, but there's going to be still a presence there. Okay, there's going to be a lot of people looking up, oh, what trailers got released in San Diego Comic-Con? Okay, and there's going to be millions of people looking that up. So I think it's a pretty good date, assuming it, does get, it doesn't get canceled. So this is a very temporary prediction. And if it does get canceled, then, I mean, I don't know, okay? If it does get canceled, well, in that case, just release it online, like, late June or July. Or even in the week, or the week, of the theoretical San Diego Comic-Con convention. Because that way, you'll seem less tone-deaf if you were to release it, you know, late June or July, as opposed to late April, okay? Because, as I've mentioned before... The virus should be teetering off by late June or July. Hopefully. Okay, I do not want this virus to keep on going through August. Just imagine that. That's just absurd, okay? We're going to have Wonder Woman 1984 getting delayed, and then that's going to screw up the fall. I don't know. I really have no idea. So, that is all for this video. Please tell me in the comments below, what are your thoughts on my trailer prediction? Just to summarize, I think... San Diego Comic Con is pretty uh, pretty probable. If not, then I would still say like late June to July, which I know it seems like a very short marketing campaign, and I would have agreed with that like a few months ago. But we're not living in normal times right now, guys. So they're gonna have to do something about it. And plus, all the other movies that Godzilla vs Kong is competing with already essentially finished their marketing. We have Black Widow. There's there's literally been TV spots. And trailers all out no time to die a bunch of TV spots and trailers those are the two main competitors right now and their marketing is completely done essentially so I think those movies are kind of screwed their hype is gonna get annihilated just like King of the Monsters except ten times worse potentially so I don't know we'll see so that's all for this video please send in comments below what are your thoughts and give me your own predictions in the comment section below this is all for this video or scroll like and comment this is the method of kaiju signing out